part of the assessment to be a living donor is are you the primary caregiver? Are you the primary breadwinner of your family? So a lot of people volunteered for assessment. She is the only one that I know that thought through because she had to take time off of work to travel to Pennsylvania to see the transplant surgeons to be tested and have psychological evaluations. She had to arrange with her employer to take time off, which her employer was very supportive of her. Um, she wasn't sure if she would get short-term disability, and she worked for a colorectal doctor in the Mount Carmel Health Network, and they said, you know, if you have a problem with your short-term disability paying out, because they had said, this is an elective surgery. This isn't something that you need to do. And they said, you know, it's, it's not breast augmentation. You're saving a child's life. So they, um, they actually came and visited her in her post-transplant care, and they made sure she didn't have to second-guess her choice. So you're obviously bound to that family <coughs> in, a, in an intimate way. I mean, they gave you something that you can't put a price tag on. Yeah, but she's... She's, um, she's never called me out on it, but um, she's just happy to have done it, so. She's a big Harry Potter fan, so her biggest joke was that, like, post-transplant, he was like her horcrux, because they couldn't be in the same room, because he's like, no, no, he would cry whenever, she, he likes her now, but um, we used to joke around about it, it's like, oh, you're a wizard and you'll live forever, because a little part of you's in Harvey. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Well, if you're a Harry Potter nerd, it's like funny. Yeah, <laughs> so. my kids read it. I didn't, so I, I've seen one or two of the movies. But um, so does she see him every once in a while now? She does. So she's actually um, pursuing being a nurse practitioner right now. Um, but she um, is an ER nurse mm -hmm. here at Riverside. Oh, okay. So yeah. she uh, is still saving people's lives. Mm-hmm.